turn now to King Charles, who was admitted to the hospital for surgery. Maggie Rooley has the latest from London. Good morning, Maggie. Hey, Michael, good morning. Yeah, just a few hours ago, the King's motorcade pulled up right here outside this hospital as both he and the Queen arrived for what the palace is calling, quote, uh, scheduled treatment. Uh, you might remember just last week, the palace had announced that Charles would be undergoing surgery for his enlarged prostate and would be taking some time off from his royal duties. Uh, guys, it is very rare to get this level of medical information from the royals like this, but the palace has said that Charles has really wanted to raise awareness about prostate state issues in men. Just today, the palace released a statement saying his majesty would like to thank all of those who have sent their good wishes over the past week and is delighted to learn that his diagnosis is having a positive impact on public health awareness. Michael. Yeah, it is good that he's bringing more public awareness to it. And Charles, he's also having a procedure at the same hospital where his daughter-in-law Kate is recovering from abdominal surgery. Yeah, that's right, Michael. We understand that both Charles and Camilla, the king and queen, visited their daughter-in-law, Kate, just this morning at the hospital. Now, it, while it seems rare to have two royals in the hospital like this, it does make sense from a security standpoint that they're both in this hospital behind me. But again, it is so rare to have two senior members of the royal family in the hospital at the same time like this. Now, guys, uh, we've all have been watching and, and hoping good things for Kate. We do understand that the palace initially said she'd be in the hospital for 10 to 14 days. Today is day 10. She has asked for privacy. Her team has been very tight lipped, but they did say she's doing well. So I think we can all send her good wishes. Hope she's on their way home soon. Get home to her family and those three little kids of hers. Guys. Yeah, wish them both the full recovery. Thank you so much.